delivering command messages and relaying the pulse of the more than 91,000 men and women that make up the enlisted ranks of the Air National Guard can be daunting. Command Chief Master Sergeant of the Air National Guard, James Hotailing, takes it one unit, one airman at a time. A recent stay in Hawaii allowed the chief to get to know the Hawaii Air National Guard, meet its airmen, and learn about the issues important to them. The importance of uh, getting out of Washington, D.C. and actually getting into the operational Air National Guard organizations from the office of the command chief's perspective is that we have to understand reality. And the only way that you can do that is by talking and seeing the airmen in action. Chief Hotelling spoke about his key focus areas, such as renewing the commitment to the profession of arms and maintaining the health of the force. In line with his third focus area of recognizing accomplishments, Chief Hotelling gave out his coin to several deserving airmen. Recognize and embrace the fact that we are awesome in what we do every single day in the Air National Guard. We need to make sure as supervisors and leadership that we recognize the airmen for what they do. Chief Hotelling was also able to visit some of the Hawaii Air National Guard's geographically separated units such as the 293rd Combat Communications Unit on the island of Kauai, the 291st Combat Communications Unit on the island of Hawaii, and the Mount Ka'ala Air Force Station, located on top of Oahu's highest peak. For the Hawaii Air National Guard, I'm Senior Airman Orlando Corpus.